Arturo has been chosen, one of his paintings has been chosen to be a part of a humongous exhibition that's going to open next year at the Los Angeles County Museum of Art. But I'm just going to have one painting in the show. I don't know the other artists how many paintings are going to have. We're in section five of the Made in California exhibition, uh, Made in California Art, Image, and Identity, 1900 to 2000. It's the largest show that the museum has ever done. It covers something like 50,000 square feet of space and 100 years of art made in the state. We are in section five, which covers the 1980s and the 1990s. Made in California is not a survey of 100 years of art made in the state. It's a thematic exhibition. And in its broadest um, theme, what it's concerned with is images of California, again, taken in the most open sense of the term. So on one hand, you could have really uh, representational images of aspects of the state, um, and on the other, you could have representations of the state that are largely symbolic. The process for curating this exhibition was quite complicated because we had so many curators working on it. What we did was we started with the largest possible checklist that we could. In other words, all of the work that interested us, that we felt fit into the themes of the exhibitions, we presented and at, at different points our checklist was very large and then we slowly whittled it down because we had to because of space considerations. The painting was uh, changed hands three times. It was sold in 1995 and the wife of the person that bought it uh, couldn't handle the image. So um, the, this person took the piece back and was resold to another person and the same thing happened. I don't know if it was exactly the same situation but again it was resold until the gallery owners rebought the piece and um, the museum selected that one. The piece selected for uh, the LACMA show, we had already sold to another collector, and a few weeks after he bought it, he brought it back because the wife didn't like it. And so what my sister and I did without even thinking twice, you know, we said we'll buy it back from you. And we just decided to keep it in the collection of the gallery. I was just very interested in Arturo Maman's images of Los Angeles as a kind of, they're sort of dystopic images. One of the, the themes that you get um, in the exhibition is the, is the play back, back and forth between utopia and dystopia. And certainly in the 1980s and especially the early 90s with the riots, with the fires, with the earthquakes, you get a lot of dystopic images of Los Angeles. And I think that his images of Los Angeles, uh, of, of, you get dystopic images of the state as a whole, uh, a lot of different locations within it. I think his images of Los Angeles fit perfectly.